Learning to ice skate can be slightly difficult, but learning how to skate synchronized with 10 other people? The skill for this can be extremely tough to master, with many synchronized ice skaters starting at a young age. But I started skating when I was, I think, four. But for sophomore Karina Grohoskaya and junior Athena Sang, that skill has led them to the ISI synchronized skating competition in Boston on Saturday. The competition was delayed by a year due to the COVID-19 pandemic, leading to higher anticipation within the team. I think I'm really excited and I think the rest of our team is really excited, especially because we get to compete at a higher level this year as well. And we're just excited to get out of, see other teams, see what they're doing. For synchronized skating coach Lisa Cushley, seeing the girls grow in their pursuit of first place in the competition has been a fun part of the process. So the best part of teaching the team is when you start off the program at the beginning of the season and the girls just look at you as if you're clueless because you come up with these ideas and they just look at you like, you are crazy, we are never going to get that. We're now at the stage where they've got it and it's all together and it's looking really good. Winning is often the ultimate goal, but the joy of skating comes from something else. I think my favorite part is probably just skating with your friends. I think also the competitiveness is a, a fun part of it as well, but um, definitely the skating with your friends as well is pretty fun. Reporting for WTV, this is DJ Krilowitz.